We are live. Hello, Miss Lucy Femme Hi. Fatale, who is now just Lucy Fatale. She dropped that femme yeah. part. Yeah, she's yeah. not femme anymore. Not with those boobs. Right. It was fire. <laughs> That's what it was. It was it was Lucy Fire Fatale. And <sighs> the funny thing is, is like I found like it was one of those names where it was like everybody had Lucy Fire because it's like this like, you know, mm. like one of those like, you know, mocha latte is that, kind of names. Is that a <laughs> is that a, like a Michigan thing? I don't know, no, because there's a bunch of other people, like, kind of around, you know, the country. The girl who um, who was, like, in Runner to be, like, the National Drag Monster had it, and oh, okay. I don't know. And, and a bunch of circus performers, so I was like, I need something to, like, where if you Google search me, it's going to, like, show me. It pops up, like, right, right. People, yeah. Well, we are doing remote learning today with Muffy Fishbasket and Miss Lucy Fatale, and we are going to learn how to do jewelry. And many different yes. kinds. So if you have questions, Miss Lucy is uh, the one to ask. Now, um, later on, uh, Miss Lucy will show you a crown that she created and designed especially for me. Hello, Dixie Ray. Um, we'll show that <laughs> later. <laughs> and you can see all of her artwork. So I'll tell you if there's any questions. If anybody has any questions as we go along, uh, please let us know and I will uh, yeah. let Lucy know. Um, Thank you. I was going to say I can't see any questions right. or any, any anything. Right. So. so I actually chose this hair especially for this. I made it make sure it's really big and uh, full of hairspray. Since we're playing with fire, I figured that that would keep it from catching on fire. Girl, you better take that off. <laughs> You're going to burst into flames. Ooh! All right. Well, yeah. we're just going to go with this That's hair then. Like it, yeah, That's okay, like, here we go. Let's... That's more like, you know, rogue jewelry making time. Right, right. <laughs> I'm ready for is, Etsy. Is that Randy on your shirt from um, from Pee Wee's Playhouse? It is. I am wearing is a Pee Wee's Playhouse dress uh, later on when I. Yeah, there's. Uh, you'll see when I move the thing down so that they can see what I'm doing while they see what you're doing. Uh, you'll also see uh, the clock. What was his name? Was it just Clocky? I don't remember. Yeah, I think just, it was like, like Clocky. Yeah, I think or, Cherry yeah. is on my yeah, butt. Cherry. You know? <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I was gonna say. Yeah, I was I going was like, for like a full '80s vibe today with yeah, my uh, I was, my charm. Oh yeah. Class. I was uh -huh, putting together right? my. I was putting together my look, and I was like doing my makeup, and I was like, I'm just gonna go like orange and pink to match this thing. Right. And I was like being on Muffy shows, like being at Pee Wee's Playhouse. So oh, it like... totally is. <laughs> yes, girl. Yes, I want all the colors, all of them. Right. Hi, Vivian. <laughs> Vivian Deshore is here. <laughs> so. Um, you told me, there was a few things that you told me to get. You actually, she actually sent me a list and then I was like, can you just send me the links? Cause girl, I don't know. So we have the, the most fun one. Yeah. The blowtorch. <laughs> oh, we have the um, same one. Okay. I think we do have the same one. The <laughs> other one that on I, Amazon, <laughs> yes. <right? laughs> the other one that I got was cheaper and it didn't work. I was pissed. Right. Um, and then we have the mutter. Yeah. Which is the, yeah. uh, what you use to, uh, weld things together. Uh, right. You also you tell me to get. Sure, oh, sorry. Go you want to make sure when you get the blowtorch that you also get the butane to go with it. Yes. If yes. you're ordering, and um, you also want to get a resin core solder, lead free oh, resin okay. core solder. Right. That's that's what you sent me. That's yeah. what I got. There, there's a so jewel, you, like if you go jewelry making solder that um make sure you make sure you get resin core though. But I'm going to show you two different ways. I'm going to show you. Um, well, I'm going to show you three different ways because see like these earrings here. Does one of them include this? Cause yes. this is how I make jewelry. Yes. No, I was going to go through that. Just like I was going to say, okay. Again, just these are just earrings from the dollar store with rhinestones E6000 on them. Oh, okay. So I'll just show you the stuff we have yes. to get for that. If you um, E6000 is great. It crystallizes in your lungs when you breathe it in. It so does. that you have pretty yeah, lungs. It does. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, you they also told it. me, yes to get these um, little hooks that you have on the back of, um, can you see them? Right. Uh, they go on the back uh, of the thing. And you said this was for dangly earrings. These are a uh, uh, fun. Hi, Susan. Hi, Gregory. Uh, who else is here? Brian. Oh, hi, Brian Reeds. Hi. Oh, oh, I hope you're feeling I better heard, soon. I know, I was just gonna say. I saw he had a, <laughs> you know. Yes. An inflammation of something. Yes. <laughs> he told me he was ready to ring not the bells. Sex. Yeah, not sex related. <laughs> yes. 
So, right. Probably. For once, for once, somebody from Camp It doesn't have a sex-related <laughs> sex injury. Yeah. Right. <laughs> a fall. So, possibly. and then also, uh, <laughs> to quote Dixie Lynn Cartwright, if you're anything like me, um, I have just tons upon tons of broken jewelry right. that um, that I I just say because it's like it's so sparkly and pretty, like you just don't want to get rid of it. Yeah, like you so, can always, you know, before oops, I sorry, used to know how to do jewelry, I'm actually, I'm going to take these, uh, I have these nail gloves on. I'm going to take them off because they're getting caught on all the jewelry. Oh, okay. So don't mind, don't mind my beastly hands when we're doing this. Because <laughs> She's a man. I know. I, I even like these gloves make it so like you can't even see the hair. So I right. don't shave I know. I need to get some of those. Because that's, <laughs> that's the only way I'm going to wear, that's the only way I'm going to wear nails. Girl. They'll be six feet long and lime green. <laughs> yes, done. I <laughs> love it. So with the broken jewelry, yes. If you have jewelry that is like, if you got drag jewelry from somewhere, it'll most likely come apart with just heat. Um, if not, if it's say like you got it from like, um, like a beauty supply or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, what will happen? Which is let's face it, to, a lot of us do that. Right. You might have to cut it apart and that in that way you might be sacrificing like every other stone because you might crush some of them because they're like sure. together right, right. um but uh oh and play-doh that you, was the other thing that we needed yeah yeah and then the play-doh and the play-doh is just to hold the jewelry in place so right. when you have that down you smash the rhinestones or whatever into it. Oh, um and i also like have that. some like Ooh. new stones um just to give like examples um, like a larger rhinestones, what you would do on the back with them and stuff. Right. But we'll focus on like that. So I'm using jewelry. things like this. Giant right. Yeah. Ass rhinestones. If, yes. Also, if any of those are gold on the back, you'll want to sand that off because now the gold they're silver. Is like a, okay. Yeah. Right. Most of the time, the silver is okay unless it was jewelry already. If it was okay. jewelry already, I was going to mention we might have to sand it anyway. Um, because a lot of that jewelry is electroplated and you want to get that coating off of there because okay. the solder only bends to like, I think it's zinc and copper, but it's underneath that, like the electrode. Ooh, it's bougie. It's bougie I know it solder. is. Isn't, doesn't this feel very mask for mask? Talking <laughs> right? About mask for mascara? <laughs> when we start pulling out all the jewels? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... Do we want to start? So um, another example that I found within my broken jewelry was something like this, the bib necklaces, but then it's actually put on felt. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So I actually brought up some felt. So that's an interesting way. And it's like one of those things that you don't always think of to do. So like I have the sticky felt and sometimes it's like I'll just like fold it in half, stick it together, um, makes it a little bit thicker. And when yeah. you think about it, you can just like glue whatever you want to it, which of course is yeah right honestly. up my alley. Yep, you can so do you can go like crazy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you can go crazy. I mean, I have oh, speaking of which, I have this necklace here, the mirror. Right. So yeah, I and it's like I love I and I've seen on Etsy like the the people that will take like the old um uh like these the um the enamel flowers. And they'll do like the big bib necklaces, but they actually drill through, add the rings, do all that stuff. Right. But girl, like yeah. you can just glue it to some felt. We drag yeah, queens, you know, girl. You I, wear it for two minutes and it's off, okay? Right. And I've seen people even make bracelets out of like uh, the cardboard from tape, you know, like oh, the cardboard inside yes. the tape. Um, and just um, rhinestone um, that. Yes. Uh, Dominique, Di or <laughs> Dominique uh, Devereaux from season one of Camp One and Kiki. Um, she actually did, like, she had made crowns like that. Like, she is the crafting queen. Like, she does that stuff, and it looks so good. So, right. yes, yeah. that is another way. Yes, that's another and the, amazing... And that's good. Yeah, that's a good thing for people who are just, even just starting out in drag, and they don't have anything. Right. Like, don't be afraid to just do something like that and glitter it. Just give yourself, like, some accessories. That's what you right. want. And when you're and on thing stage, is, like, you can't tell sometimes. Exactly. You're on stage and you're moving around. Like, it looks empty if you don't have something, but right. it could be literally anything. I mean, when you think about it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I've done, like, br little, like, broken pieces of glass and stuff, like mm -hmm. mirrors and stuff. That sounds um, dangerous. Yeah, it was. Oh, my God. This one. So my, my drag grandmother, Natalie Cole, she gave me a hug in the outfit, and she cut her, like, cut her hand. 
and it was like, God. I and then you like, laughed and walked away. You're like, no, I was in the middle of, a, I was in the middle of like a hand down number after a pageant. I Girl, nowadays you like, do not want to, everybody, you do not want to do that nowadays because you'll get sued. Right. <laughs> True. Girl. Truly. truly. Well, let's um, get started. Should we start with like yeah. the glue and then move up to the other? Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to put my uh, phone up here. So if you, I won't be able to see, I might be able to see you a little. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, no, I won't. Duh. Cause it's going to be, hold on. I'll just I'm tell you what, what was happening. Look at her. She got, that. That. she got fancy with that. She got fancy with how she's doing this. Oh, girl. I'll... No. Oh, bitch. If you see, look at this. This is a some wire and a piece of clear glass. <laughs> from my I said you, but so, look at you. Well, yeah. Come on, this now. is my fancy studio. Innovation, I love it. innovation. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so, um, I have one of these. This is like, it's oh, a, yes, those are great. a wax wand for rhinestones. Mm -hmm. so you can pick them up yes. one at a time. Um, and then E6000, that's always suggested. Yes. <laughs> and again, and then, uh, be be careful with it, but you know it's one of those things that it is one of the strongest glues. And what's great about it is is that it's flexible, so it doesn't get yeah. uh, brittle. And um, I have moved to what's the other? There's another one um, like that I use for costumes. Yeah, um, like gem tack kind of. Yes, that's that's what I use. Yeah. Um, but with that one, you have to be really careful with your costumes and. Um, uh, washing them because it will slide. Right. Uh, yeah. Yes, I've had Especially gemstones move. Yes. So be very careful. Hand wash is probably better. Right. So I'm really big into um like I want to start making uh like things for hair because you see drag yeah. queens and it's always the flowers like it's always the flowers and whereas right. that can be classic I think that we can do better. So, yeah, um, I have one. I have this thing here. I don't, is it right there? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a, it's what a did star you make broken. that on? Is it just I, a... That's out of, it's some brooches. Oh, okay. Now, did you yeah, just pin that from, through? Girl, yeah, that's from, it's from okay. Clark Street. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, girl. Yes. That's, that's, oh, yes. <laughs> um, so, I'm going to take, like, and the thing that you have to be careful about, of course, is being, um, your stuff being too heavy. Like, you have to be careful. Right. So. Yeah, I mean, unless you're willing to glue on your earrings, which I do sometimes. Like, right. for these puppies here, you got to, like, really... Yes, that's a... But there, they look good. You know? They look good when they're there. They do. They do. You can't move your head, but you're fine. You know, right. you'll be fine. <laughs> Three so minutes, that's more. Fine. that's more for just a... Uh, when you're doing that, that initial runway look, you're just, like, walking yeah, down right. the runway. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. Um, so this technique, you know, will also work on any old thing. If you wanted to do like rhinestone, a, a coffee cup or a, you oh, know, okay. a vase or something, mm -hmm. this E6000 does all surfaces. So it does glass, metal, plastic, yes. uh, wood. Um, so I'm just going to go right here. Cause this is a piece of like spare glass I have. Um, so I'm just going to go right here on this just to demonstrate, like to picking up the stones and stuff. Okay, so you keep talking. You... I'm gonna be right back. Okay, so you okay. keep talking. I'll be right back. Yeah. So uh, when you want to start stoning something, so we'll say this: this is our area we want to stone. Um, you only want to dab down a small amount of glue. You don't want it like gushing out of the edges when you uh, glue something down. Um, so I'm gonna stop there with the glue, and then this little wand thing picks up the rhinestones so you'd want to pick them up and then dab them there pretty easy and straightforward but like muffy was saying you can do this to anything really so i have rhinestones here here's some pieces of uh mirror um and even when it comes to like this old broken rhinestone like say you wanted to just do this rhinestone on there you can pop this out of here and just stick it wherever, you know. And you can even do that to clothes and stuff. E6000 works on dresses. It works on um, all kinds of fabrics. Do a swatch test first, though, because it can melt some things. Um, so, yeah, so that's pretty straightforward, I would say. That's, like, that's about it there. Oh, Muffy, Muffy's right back. back at the... She's back. back right at the end of it. 
So yes. I was just saying it's pretty straightforward. You know, glue down, stones on, or whatever on. Sorry, I had to go away. One of my dogs is puking on the floor. That's how much he likes your tutorial. Yeah. He was That's like, oh, I got work. something to say about that. Yeah, right. <laughs> Because it's sick, man. <laughs> so, yes, that's what it is. Oh, I gotta grab scissors. Um, did she go away again? Oh, yeah, she did. This is a running theme in this show, Muffy. You disappearing. Okay, so what I'm did doing you know is... <laughs> no, what'd you say? I said this is starting to be a running theme in this show, Muffy. You just disappear. <laughs> I know. I, I know. I always forget things. So what I'm doing is I have my felt that I'm going to um, make a headpiece on. I'm just going to cut it. Uh, and I'm going to do it in some sort of ish shape. And then what yeah. I like to do is like figure out the shape that you want. And then um, you can just fill it from there. It's just like you were doing, you know, any drag anything like you know you have a dress yeah. it's a shape you're stoning it so i'm taking a circle um and then the other thing that i found is um so my main piece is going to be this lovely little green and blah 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 and i'm just going to glue that on there and then i'll just fill it in later with other things um yeah. and then something that i found that i do um that i have done with head pieces is um when i am at a thrift store if there are placemats, girl, I will pick up those placemats and I will take them because you get that <laughs> nice sturdiness to it. Yeah. Um, and then so because this yeah. isn't necessarily going to be, it's going to not, it's going to be kind of flexible, too flexible. So yeah. um, later on, I might add something to the back. And then, of course, the gator clip will go. But I'm going to fill this in with all these other like little things and it'll just be a little bleep. Something yeah. shiny, crazy, muffy ass. So yeah, and you easy can peasy. Like, uh, just glue like bobby pins or something onto the back of it too right to um so that was actually another question i didn't bring any up but i also love that would you suggest with uh like okay so i have this lovely star pin um yeah. and i was thinking oh this would be great at the end of one of those like really long bobby pins because then you just like slide it in and it's there now is that something that you would weld or something that you would glue uh, well, it really depends on what that is made out of. The, uh -huh. You know, the E6000, it'll hold it really well. You know what right. I mean? You just don't right. You want to make sure you it doesn't fall over in there or something because you've got to have the space for your hair or whatever. Right, but, but, right. Okay, yeah. so that's, so basically it's more or less like play with what you can and like figure out. But yeah. If it pretty much you're good to go if it has like kind of that silver back to it. Yeah, and I would su I would suggest okay. though with that other thing, like if it's something like this and you want to stick it in your hair, I would yeah. like I would solder like a comb, like one of those metal like combs on the back. Oh, of it. okay, yeah. So it jams yeah. in there just because you don't want this falling out because if it falls, if it hits the floor, all those stones are gonna go flying. It's just shattering. Know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually have some of those um those really big they're like plastic ones and it's great because yeah. they just like they have long teeth they just slide right in. So yeah, getting them back out after you have a bunch of like things like this in it is another matter, but. That's right. another time, <laughs> another thing. Another time in so, another place. Yes. So let's make some, let's weld some jewels. Let's, uh. Okay. So we're, we're show gonna... me what kind of, like, um, jewelry you have going I on. I think I'm going to do, I'm going to, because I have these great big stones. So I think I'm going to do. Okay. Just, what do you want to make out of that? We're going to do some rings. I got these great adjustable. The ring backs. Okay. Yeah, ring backs. All right. Nice. All right, I'm going to pull out some rhinestones, too. Here, I'm going to put my phone okay. back so you guys can see. Don't look down my brassiere. <laughs> and your, your real <laughs> boobies. Yeah, oh, yeah, they're real, real fake. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to actually move my camera down so that everybody can kind of see what I am doing as well. Oh, my boobies. Oh, and okay, I just so, lost everybody, so yeah. let me try oh. that again. There we go. Okay. Oh, perfect. So that's what. So you take your play doh and smash it down. Yeah. So you want to okay. set these. We get all this other crap out of the way. All right. So this is where, like, you know, some creativity, you know, can come into play. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't want to just jam these down. Like, if you have all kinds of stones, you can, you can like band these with, like, lay so it down and kind of. Like, how would you band them together? Like, what would you use? Just like chain. Well, like what you do is you would like lay it lay it out kind of and see how okay. you can. So 
if that's how you want it to look, say like that, very hard okay. at the ocean. Um, right. Then, then you would just do it upside down in this clay. Okay. So you, then you would want to lay it around like that, you know, and then, then we'll get to like the welding part of it. It's, okay. it's actually fairly, fairly straightforward. It just so mine is pretty easy because like I'm just doing like one thing with okay with the the yeah. ring back. So and yeah, and it works the same way with you know this the the torch and all that it's going to mm-hmm. work the same way whether you're gl- like doing this part or doing the ring back on it or an earring back or whatever okay so okay let me get an let me get an earring back around here someplace <laughs> and i'll just show that i have all this crap everywhere because i'm always in the middle of a thousand projects of course same i understand <laughs> I was like, I need a new outfit for the tonight. <laughs> <laughs> earlier, you know, earlier today, I think. Right, of course. <clears throat> so, okay, we're gonna get blowtorch in here. Okay. You gotta make sure that I'm on scared. the side there's right <laughs> on the side there's a a little bit of or a um, a plus and minus. You can turn it up and right. down. You want it probably like three quarters of the way up. You don't want it the hottest it can go, okay. but you don't want it that cool either. Okay. So then when you click it on, this uh-huh. is actually a, a fast process kind of here. So okay. you want to you wanna heat this stuff, but you don't want it to be red hot. So okay. Why, wait, what like, am I heating? The, the, uh... the, the backing of the, um, the, oh, oh. the jewel. Okay. So go maybe eight seconds on it. <laughs> Excuse me. Two, three. Okay. Okay. And then... Then Ooh, you, you touch it too. The, Ooh, yeah, Ooh, okay. You dab and then the do I solder put this? on there. Yep, dab the solder on there. You can see it melted in there. And I just made a big. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to go back at that again because it cools. I didn't. See, it cools pretty see. quick, doesn't it? Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm watching it now. Hi, everybody. I don't know who's watching. <laughs> okay, I'm touching. I'm touching. I'm touching. And then get that ring in there. Yep. Ooh. And it's completely the wrong way, but whatever. Whatever. Yeah, no, no, no. Here, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Pick it. Pick the ring back up, with, or hold it with the needle nose pliers. Ah, okay. Yeah, not your. <laughs> you should have waited until I finish that first, right? <laughs> so okay. now, like, press it where you want it with that solder down on there, and now heat both of those up oh, with okay. the torch. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay, okay, now yep, now hold it down there and just let Let's it go see on what top happens. of there. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Scared. Don't be. Nope. Didn't no, didn't take. Yet. Okay, uh, well wait, leave it put it back where it was. Like in Alright, we're just gonna we're just gonna leave it there because it's still kinda melty. Yeah, yeah. It does you know, solder takes a little bit to dry sometimes. Like okay. it takes uh, you know, I mean, Now do you ever go it, back over and put like solder on the top to kind of like lock it into place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you'll want to do once that's in the place where oh, you want it. Oh, oh, it did it. Okay. 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 Now, now take the torch again. Okay. And torch, torch around like the ring base, like so okay. that's where you want it to go. I'm just putting some solder in there. Let's just yeah. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah. Yeah. Look at look at you're melting. Yeah. Oh God, it's just gonna be a Turn whole lot of solder on. in the back there. Yeah, you don't want to oh! leave the torch on too long because. Oh! <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I burnt the Play-Doh. Yeah, no, I you burn the Play-Doh. That happens. Oh, okay. But no, wait, yeah. So what you'll want to do is, like, afterward, there's going to be, like, Play-Doh scorched all to the front of them. <laughs> They're totally so, is so <laughs> What you're going to want to do is, like, I Can take my see that? Oh, it's, it's okay like, for, like, your first try. Look at that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> No, honestly, look at mine though. See, Burn that Play Doh, girl. Yeah, she right. said this Play Doh used to be white. Right. <laughs> you can see right here though. Now that is soldered onto it. It's kind of fun. It is. You get some aggression out on it. Right. So yeah, I'll do. It. I'll just finish. It. <laughs> I wish I could like Stinky. zero in. Can I? No, I can't zoom in. Well, zoom in okay, on those boobies. So, right. My dad, look, I'm going to do this. Bitch, we could start a fans only. <laughs> right there. Just right there. 
<laughs> is it her butt cheeks or is it her boobs? Yeah, it's jewelry, air quotes. No. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll just finish this piece here. Uh, Gregory Booth Vanderwell asks, I need a rhinestone studded leather harness. May I commission you? He Hell must be talking yeah. to you. No, do you want to do it? Yeah, let me do it. I'm we'll doing so do well it. right now. We'll both do it. Let's both do one. Yeah. Okay. I think I just added like, there's probably more like soldering stuff in here right now than there is actually anything else. Yeah. <laughs> well... Yeah, you're like, yeah. I don't know. All right. Well, this is cooling now. Okay. We're going to see what happens once this cools. All right. Does I'm going to cool move. like pretty quick. I mean, I'm within a few it. minutes. Okay. Let we'll that go. Within a few minutes. So. Okay. <laughs> so um, don't touch it quite yet. Right. I'm going to go over like another kind of soldering though. So I'm going to move okay. this piece that I have over and I'm going to go through like using a wand, a soldering wand. Oh yes. Um, that was a question that I actually had because um, now do you find that easier? I actually do, but I, you know, I worked in stained glass before I did. Oh, work. okay. So, um, Fancy. so I was used to it already. You know, mm -hmm. and, in, and in that way, for that, you would get, it's a different kind of solder. You get, it's not resin pour. Um, it's just a regular, like, jewelry solder. I feel like we're solder. doing CBS. This, this, this ring. Yeah. Be, it needs to be on, like, one of those rotating tables. <laughs> right. Yeah, you know, with lights shining on it so you can right. see it sparkling. Oh, um, God. So, yeah, so I think this way is easier for me and I can get a better Okay, I'm excited to see. Let's see it. Um, but it's a little bit more expensive because you have to buy the soldering wand. Okay. Um, which, let me see if I can. I feel this. like I probably have one in my. Okay. But oh, yes, yes, sure, yes. Okay. Make sure that it's 120 volts or 100 watt. It can't be like a 60 watt because it won't melt the solder. Correctly. Okay. So. So it has Wait, what's the soldering? Wire. What's those soldering stuff called? The metal? Um, this is just it's soldering wire, I guess. Oh, okay. Solder, I think is what or it's called. Mutter. But it's yeah, mutter. It's well, it's like S O L D E R. Yeah, is how you would look yeah. for it. Yes. Okay. Um. Or you so, just contact Lucy and she sends you a list of the things you gotta buy. That's yeah, what there's I do. like you should get, <laughs> you should get jewelry. Like if you look up, there's jewelry solder. I um, mean, you can even oh, get okay. this in, you can get it in silver, really, too, if you were wanted, you know. Oh, so, okay. Um, if you want to get all fancy. Right. <laughs> fancified. <laughs> so, um, with this, you would need you would need the solder. You would need what's called flux. That's this stuff here. So, that is... Oh, okay. Oh, okay, yes. This is something that I... Like, when I started researching this stuff, like, they started pulling out all this stuff, and I was like, I have no idea. Right. Well, flux, what it does is it... It coats the surface of um, the piece, and it enables the solder to flow in between all of the spaces. And in the okay. resin, in the resin core solder, the core of it is flux. So when you melt it, it does it all in one step. Um, okay. And then with this way, you have to spread the flux on there. Um, but uh, oh, this is on fire. I just feel like <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I get a better finish from this way, but. You can okay. do it any way you like. Oh. A lot of people, a lot of people like the torch method. So, well, I um, just, right, I just this set this little here. thing on fire over here. Did you? Well, yeah, yeah. It happens. Well, because it's plasticky. Fire, you know? Yeah, it's plasticky. Yeah. So, it's, you know, that's how I so, like my jewels, nice and plastic. Right, plastic, Kenny. Um, so, what you would do is you would turn on your soldering iron for this method. Okay. Then, um, Wait, let it heat okay. up because it heats up to I think fifteen hundred degrees. Oh, so it's very hot. And another thing is, is like you also want to unplug this. And I stay in the room until it's cool to the touch because if it falls over or something and it's on like a wooden table, it could oh. go up twenty minutes after you turn that off. Oh, okay. So that's, so that's another just fun. a safety warning. Yeah. Okay. But, um. So you want to brush the flux onto the piece and get it like. Is in it like a powder? These. No, it's like a it's like a gloopy paste. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know where it is. It's like it's like this kind of like mucky 
paste. They also have liquid solder or liquid flux, which I like too. And but that's almost just like water, and you brush it on though. Uh, okay. So, okay. So with this way, you would um, do that. So I, I oh I also have a wet washcloth. Because with the, the solder iron, you want to wipe it off just to get the, like, carbon off of it. Because it sure. gets black and that'll... Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, you'll just... What you want to do is um, you'll touch the, the solder to the iron. And it'll, like, ball up on the edge there. And then you just touch it to the metal. So, you can just... You can press it down on the metal or whatever. Okay. But... You'll want to make sure that it's flowing in between the space, in between all of the rhinestones, and in between the uh, the rhinestone chain and the large stone. Like you want to make sure that that looks like a solid piece of metal, pretty much. Oh, okay. Um, like I mean, you'll be able to see the definition of the the stones, but so Girl, so this I is just all did very that. Involved. It is, isn't it? It's like you know, it's a co complicated order. <laughs> <laughs> I got a complicated order over here. Right. So it's um it's still drying right now. But I'll be able to show you any minute. Okay, so then see then if you see the back of that, how smooth it is, I don't know if you can. I'm gonna put it in here. Okay. Like, see the finish on it? Uh-huh. It, it just, to me, is a lot better than, like, some of the other stuff. It's, like... It's well, this like, is very, yes. like, the way that we did it is very gloopy, like, on the back. Yeah. Like, there's, like, a definite... It's not pretty on the back. Right. Like, and, I mean... Of course, it's it's towards your skin, and as long as it's not cutting you, it's fine. Nobody sees it. Right. Girl, that's what, that's what drag's about. It's all about illusion. Right. But, you know, the thing with it is, is uh, as you learn how to do it, it gets smoother over time. Right. You know? But see, like that now is like the top of something, you know, it could be, I'm going to hold it this way more because then you can see the light, I guess, better. See? And it could be, oh, yeah. you know, uh -huh. it could be a bindi or an earring. Or <laughs> so whatever. did you, so did you did it start out, when you started that out though, was that just the blue and then you put the other stuff around it? Yep. I put the chain around it. Okay. Right. So, and there's a lot of people like you'll see jewelry that's like this, you know. Yes. What I mean? Like, mm -hmm. um, I right? Examples. Because it sets it, it sets it off then. Right. Yeah. And I mean, I have like different sorts all over the place. You know, different. Like I made these, and those. I are, love those. Um, I love those. Just a a hot pink off the rack affair. <laughs> right. <laughs> but then, like these ones here are. The glue, like just rhinestones glued to this base. Uh huh. So, you so it's can basically really... just using what you have available and what is yeah. at, you know. Right. And don't let anybody shame you about what kind of jewelry you have, you know what right. I mean? Because I think jewelry's jewelry. And if you're, if you like making it, make it however you want to make it, you know. But also, when you think about it, you're wearing it for, like, what? How long? How long are you going to be on stage wearing right. it? Right. You know, it's, like, yeah, it's there to, to make the impact, and then you're off stage and, you know, being flawless. And, right. you know, if you're being entertaining and you're doing your job as a queen, nobody's going to even notice, like, a mishap or something. Yeah, that you lost an earring. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. <laughs> I've lost many an earring in my day. <laughs> Rhinestones <laughs> just falling all over the place. Right. Oh my yeah. goodness. <laughs> so let's make a couple other things and um, yeah, and take any questions. If anybody has any questions, please let us know. Uh, Miss Lucy yeah. is here to answer all of your questions, whether they yeah. be about jewelry or not. Yeah. Oh, jewelry well, or not. Work. It can oh, be like. Uh, and that's hot. It's hot. It is. You know, another thing you can do is if you keep something like a dish of shallow water, you can kind of... Oh, like, clever, clever, clever. Yeah, or a wet washcloth is what mm -hmm. I, like, I like to have just because it really cools it down. So but I'm trying way, to do one of these clips, but I think probably with the clips, like we were saying, probably the best way to do them is probably with the felt and the glue. If you can glue yeah. it, glue it. Yeah, really, because but all of that is, you know, it's not just like experiment not, figure. 
Yeah. And a lot of stuff, you know, it looks horrendous on the inside. Like a lot of these outfits, it's like paper mache on the inside, but on the outside, right. Good, right. You know? Well, right. And it's like, you know, uh, these rings, it's like, okay. So the backside, it's like not, wait, let me get to where it is. It's oh, yeah. not in the center. It's like, it's gloopy, but you know what? You put it on and you wear it for like how long and you're done. Right. Like, yeah. Girl. This I mean, I've little... even had rings where I've just glued a little thing to my hand, you know? Oh, <laughs> like, right. Oh, oh yeah. Know. That's, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, done. Like, just a little yeah, done. stupidness. It's uneven. It's like, but that's, you know, on brand for me. So that totally works. Yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. You with sell this. uneven, girl. <laughs> right, girl. <laughs> Muffy thinks it works for her. So that's all right. that matters. Yeah, yeah this so is really fun. And I think that this is like, I'm going to keep working on this one over here. Um, I think there's, like, so much that people can do. Um, yeah. And I mean, like, and, if you also, here's, I just wanted to show a side-by-side. -side. Like, this here is the torch. That's the torch uh, uh -huh. jewel. And this one is the not torch jewel. So it doesn't, uh, not as much of that Play-Doh sticks to it with sure. the not torch method, too. Like, right. this, you have to kind of take a... Uh, like a dish brush or something and soak it in water to get that out of there. So, okay. But oh, it's all trial and error, you know, as long as you make sure you're may... not setting any fires. Right. Oh, I think I may have done it. It actually stuck. This little... Scoot it over a little bit to your left, I think. Okay, hold on. Uh, let me get some of this Play-Doh out of here. Oh, <laughs> it's still really hot. It um, is. That's hot. Uh, there it is. Oh, yeah. So it's oh, just yeah. like, yeah. Like, sit, yeah. like, once you shove that into a wig, girl, style that hair around there, you're good to go. Yeah, that's cute. Girl. And I'm into it. And honestly, if you scrub, if you scrub this stuff off with like a dish brush like that, a lot of that, like that blackening and stuff, will come off. Right. Like that. Just put I it through the a, dishwasher. Yeah. Right. No. <laughs> I, use, <laughs> I, I use like a magic eraser on the back of it. Oh too, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's out. clever. Uh huh. And you yes. want to make sure this flux. Um, flux, which is in the center of that the torch stuff, it is like acidic, so it'll irritate the skin and stuff if you um, if you don't wash it off. So you do have to make sure to wash that. Stuff uh, Vivian Dujour has a question about stone. She said, "Can you talk about stone sizes? Like, what yeah. are the, the the best that you use? Like, what are yeah? Well, they go in sizes like they they're marked like SS after right. it, so it'll be like six, eight, ten." 12, 16, um, 14, or 14, 16, 18, 20. Um, and they, they go up like in increments of two. Um, and as they, you know, as the number gets larger, the stone gets larger. This here, this is a, a 14 SS. Which is great for stage. That's like right. beautiful. Right. Um, and, you know, well, the easiest way to make jewelry, though, is yeah. to just contact Lucy and have her make it for you. Yeah, I'll make it for you. I have a bunch, <laughs> of, I have a bunch of this crap laying around, bitch. <laughs> Do you have an Etsy shop? Because that no, would be, like, you should. You, know, you should. Well, it's funny because, you know, like, I hate making stuff work is all, you know. Like, when I have stuff to do. Like, I was saying the other day I was ma I keep making all these masks, you know, for everybody. Uh -huh. And oh, I was right. like, I just want to go back to making pretty things. But making right. masks is like really right. sad. <laughs> so, so what is, so is that your, the what was it, the 14? Was that the 14 stone size? Yeah, the 14, yeah. Is that your um, favorite one to use? Like for like the no. surrounding? I'm trying to think because I usually get, I can usually only get a hold of 14s, but I can't remember if it goes up or down in the size. Like if like a larger is a 12 or if a larger is oh, a 14. okay. But a lot of times you can get a millimeter reading on it too. So like that's where I like to do is. And where do you usually go for yours? Oh, I lost her. Come back, Lucy. We have more questions. She ran away. She's in her basement. It, <laughs> I'm surprised hers worked uh, better than mine. Um, Cause last week, girl, that was rough. So hopefully she'll come back. Hold on, let me go back and check for her. I'm over here just working on my craft. Um, so yeah, this was um, very informative. It's a seems a shorter one, a shorter one of my uh, things. But oh, here she comes! Here she comes! She's back! She's back! Hi. 
I don't know what happened. Hi. I don't know what happened. That's okay. Girl, did you see last week? Girl, I was all over the place. I couldn't, like, yeah, I did get this stupid thing to, like, work. I know. It's like, the the funny thing is, is it seems like the Wi-Fi goes Ooh. in and out, like, randomly. They know you're right. not going to call about it, so they're like... Right. <laughs> oh, my God. It's because everybody um, is home. Right. So, like, the millimeter thing was what I was saying. Is like, I yeah. like to go by the millimeters. And um, if you... If you print out, there's like a printable ruler um, that's a millimeter ruler. So you can just oh, print okay. out a millimeter ruler for reference when you're looking up the stones. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Um, and that's what I did is I was like, you know, I'll have the, the millimeter ruler and it'll say, you know, 18 millimeters. And so that's a little over a centimeter, but you don't really get a grasp for the size of it until you sure. like look at it. Or it's almost two centimeters. I think. Right. That's like With a lot of math. math. I can't even. It is. Yeah. So, you know, it's better because then you can just count them and say it's like whatever millimeters. And you can right. Say like a visual representation of what the size of the stone is. Um, and it's, I don't know why they make it so complicated and why they have to have like different sizes and stuff. I think. And why I think they can't was... just use inches. Right. <laughs> like the rest of the, the U.S. <laughs> right. <laughs> Only for some reason. Right. <laughs> Can't they just be like us? Yeah, right. I don't know. <laughs> That's funny. Um, Edie's here. So, Edie says hello. She said you oh, look hey, fabulous. Edie. Thanks, girl. I had a wig on, but she made me you. take it off because it was too big, yeah. apparently. It was, it was covered in spray. Fire. Right. <laughs> oh, we're done with fire. I think I can go put it back on. Hold on. I think it's right down here. Oh, yeah. We're done with fire. Ooh. Oh. My whole camera thing moved. There it is. Oh, my hearing. <laughs> oh. There we go. Very 80s, girl. Yes. I'm, I'm, feeling, before, I'm feeling 60s in this. I don't before know. Before we got started, I was like, <laughs> oh, I look like Betsy Johnson. <laughs> I'm ready to, like, design. I'm ready. Right. It's like a mix of Betsy Johnson and Dee Snyder. <laughs> um, Husbear wants to know what stone size is S S S N M M M. I, I think he's know. making things up. Right. <laughs> it's like, I don't know. I don't know, girl. <laughs> she said she doesn't know and stop asking your foolish questions. Right. No, start. Keep asking more. <laughs> yes. If anybody has any questions, Edie Moorcock, do you yeah. have any questions? Yeah. Oh, I was just gonna say I just I just messaged Evie about the pageant. Oh uh, yes, so yes. Oh, uh, the pageant, which I'm guessing is just gonna move to um, our dress. Is it fest. just not? Is it just not a fiasco every year? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what that? Michael said. Oh yeah. Is moving it to drag fast, but it the makes weekend, sense. I mean, it's a like, yeah. Yeah. It makes sense. So hopefully we can yeah. get some people. It'll be fabulous. No yeah, matter I, what we do, it'll be lovely. Yeah, I already messaged all the girls about it. So mm -hmm. we'll see. I think we have like two two commitments out of the five. Oh, it's gonna so be far, it's so. gonna be Edie's uh, birthday weekend. Oh, is it? Oh my god, we should do a, a roast. She's a cancer. I'm a cancer too. My birthday is July second. Oh yes, my husband's a cancer as well. All you homebodies. I know. I know. <laughs> I was like, what quarantine? <laughs> right? I didn't, come out I, know. Of, I didn't come out of hibernation yet. So You're I like, know. whatever, I'm good. I know. I'll stay here, bitch. I don't care. Right? <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move this down because I'm going to make another ring. Um, oh, cute. Oh. She said uh, July 17th. I'm doing a, um, it's just oh, a little nice. one, but it's like, look at this. Wait, let me find it. Oh, there it is. A little butterfly. Yeah. It's cute oh, yeah, butterfly. Cute. Cute little butterfly. Yeah. It's got a gold back though, so we're gonna see what happens. Here we go. I'm gonna experiment. Yeah, with those. sand it. Do you have sandpaper? Oh, I don't have sandpaper. Okay, well, girl, that seems like work. too much work. <laughs> it might not work, girl. I don't know. Alright, we're gonna try though. Here we go. Come on, get in there. Melt, 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 melt. Get a good amount in there. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, I lost my I lost my back. <laughs> I don't see it anywhere. <laughs> Here it is. Oh my god. 
I think I burned my hair too. <laughs> yeah. You should probably mm. also have on a small ventilation fan, maybe. I don't know. Oh. Small suggestion. Shit, tell me any of that. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're melting. We're melting. Ah! It fell over. Oh, yeah. Now it's going to be stuck. <laughs> like that. What'd you say? I said, now it's going to be stuck like that, girl. I know, right? All right, we're going <laughs> to pick this up because it's already starting to get hot. It's burnt Play-Doh smell. I do love that sound of that torch. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Now you can make creme brulee too. Right. I know. I already told my. <laughs> I already told not my husband because Muffy's not married. Uh, that yeah. this was not to be a kitchen item. This is for my jewelry making. Oh yeah. Okay. Because all we'll of my. Say. Yeah. Right. All my items end up in the kitchen. Do they? If they're if they're kitchen based. They disappear okay. out of I'm my like, studio. Well, girl, is she running those <laughs> through the dishwasher? Or <laughs> I don't know. You want to be able to clean. Yeah, don't need that Muffies. <laughs> right? You want to you wanna make sure that you uh, lend them out clean. Yeah, oh, my God. Right. Does it magnetize? Because it's, like, stuck. Oh, yeah. It's not working. I got to say that. <laughs> yeah, it's the goal. I was like, it'll work. It'll work, Lucy. No. It won't. No. Yeah, <laughs> she know, said, it won't. It won't. <laughs> Like really, she said, you nice know, try, I've bro. done. Yeah, I've also like if I needed to extend something, like I have this choker, and I've just added like a piece of copper onto the end of it because the solder oh, okay. really, really sticks to copper. So if you you can avoid. A, oh yeah, a Lady Gaga. I'm just gonna glue a little earring back I thought that to was that. Sia. Oh, it could be it could be her too. I think it was originally <laughs> right? Lady Gaga though, because it's supposed to be like her hair yeah. bow. No, I can yeah. see it. Yeah, I can see it. So we're just gonna <laughs> we're gonna e six thousand that. Yeah. Uh, it's also important. This e six thousand. It's important to remember that uh, it will keep going after you squeeze it. So yeah, have put the something. lid on it. Yeah, have a base <laughs> or something. Yep. I I keep like a a straight a little pin with a pearl on the end of it to jam in. There. Oh yes, I have done that. I have done that as well. Well, Miss Lucy, let's see if we have any other questions. Uh, no, Joel, you cannot order a burger. That's that's another show. Um, a piece of burger. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Edie Moorcock asked, um, Hi, Anthony, can you post some suggested starter kits after this? So maybe the stuff that you sent to me might be a good, like, oh, here's the like yeah. stuff that we used. Yeah. Yeah, and you know, there's also a ton of, like, jewelry-making tutorials on YouTube that have, mm -hmm. like, people... People suggest like different kinds and brands of solder and different kinds and brands of like rhinestones and different ways. Like there's a lot of people that order the backs like these, um, the, uh, this part, the metal part separately. Oh, and they, okay. they solder these together and then put the stones in after because sometimes you can heat this thing up and it'll like, it can crack the stone to, you know, this the heat oh. of the, uh. So the it's torch. definitely good to do your research and figure out like your sizes, your shapes. Yeah. And stuff. So, but are the shapes and sizes pretty standard, like across the board? They are. Yeah. They're all, they're usually measured in millimeters. I mean, there is varying, um, which we um, have an issue with. Yeah. There, there is varying <laughs> qualities though. That's the thing is like, okay. you know, you can go all the way from the real, like Chorofsky stones all the way down to like, glass crap that is mm -hmm. going and you know i'm not saying like these rhinestones which are they're pretty and they sparkle and um let me see like these rhinestones here they um you know they're like a mid-grade i guess and i i just get that stuff for like the stuff i'm making for myself but you can get like Preci preciosa and swarovski are obviously the top of the line and but you can get, you know, just look on eBay and um, mm -hmm. order order a small amount, you know, 10 of them. Like, you can get some that are, like, 10 of these for $5 or something. You oh, know that's what I amazing. Mean? Yeah, um, so, I mean, just order them from different companies and see okay, yeah, what you look Gregory, like. Yeah, yeah Gregory Booth asked, um, do you have a favorite website that you order yours from? I don't. You know, what I did is, like... My friend Dennis, he was really into, like, rhinestones and stuff for a long time. And then he had, like, kind of worked his way through a bunch of different suppliers and stuff. Um, just oh, okay. going into that stuff. And uh, 
but I don't have a favorite. And like the things I've been using tonight, I just ordered on eBay at random just to see the quality of them. So, oh, okay. So it's probably yeah. good to like, you're going to have to like invest and um, kind of just order things and figure out what it's like makeup. It's like you figure out what works it for is. you. Yeah. Um, right. Like I have done, like, I don't, I always find it funny. Like when people are stoning an outfit and they use like really expensive stones. Cause I'm like, girl, the cheap stones yeah. shine too. Like, I get the jewelry, they do. but yeah. yeah. Um, well, you know, honestly, though, if you've seen like the expensive stones and then you see them side by side with the cheaper stones, you can't uh -huh. tell the difference. You can, so yeah. It, and it, it really depends on what you're doing with it, though. Like if you're doing a Saturday sure. night show at a bar, you can use stones that are 10 <laughs> girls for $5. You know? <laughs> go to, I mean, go to, uh, yeah, go to Michael's and get those like boxes of plastic stones and just glue no, that no, shit I, on. I never suggest the, the acrylic rhinestones, girl. I don't know. Those were always, like, my nightmare. I'm like, no acrylic rhinestones ever. <laughs> no, but um, honestly, oh, like, no, I was just going to say, like, you can get, like, bags of rhinestones like this. And these are, like, I mean, these are gorgeous up close. And these were, like, five ninety nine dollars for mm -hmm. 1000 you oh, know? Okay. And you can just glue those on, on any old thing. But if you're doing a national pageant or something... You want to be able to see that costume from way far back. Sure. So if you're doing something on a huge stage, like a pride or something, I would say by all means invest in the more expensive stones. Oh, okay. You know, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. do a mix of sizes, a mix of sizes. So like, do some this size and some smaller and some round. And that's and on your square. costume. You're saying like when yeah, you're yep, yeah, costume, starting the costume. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm not like um, a rhinestone expert or anything, but I do. But, you know, but you've had, had these experiences and you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Um, Edie Morcock asks, uh, do you plate your jewelry? How does that work? Was that the what we just did? No. What, what she's asking about is electroplating. So what oh, okay. electroplating does is you like you negatively charge and positively charge. I don't remember which one because I don't do it. But you can like um, say, for instance, you put gold gold into water and you're you have it clamped to an electrical source that's like negatively charged then you positively charge this other piece of uh whatever you want to coat in it and you dip it into the water and it pulls gold from the gold to the back of the stuff and it seals it and in, in girl gold. that is already too much work <laughs> well if you have, like, i mean honestly like if you look at if, if anybody's interested in that you can look it up on youtube and it's not that complicated of a setup if you want to get into it, but it's a little bit more than just basic. I'll say that. Okay. Sure. But okay. it does stop, like, when you electroplate stuff, it does stop, um, like, if you wear, you know, like, fake jewelry and it turns your, your skin, like, green or black, it oh, will stop that. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. But you can also paint it with clear nail polish. <laughs> right, right. That's that old Which school mom trick. Yeah, yeah that's right. that old school mom um, trick. Yep. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, but like I said, you know, if you you got to make sure you're using lead free solder and like it will turn your skin green but it's not like dangerous unless you're allergic to metals you know right like my mother uh she was actually she is actually allergic to you know anything that's like not gold like if it's like cheap metal or whatever yeah it will make her break out and there are certain things that do that to me as well but that yeah. was always what she would do she would just cover the back with you know the, something the nail yeah. polish mm -hmm. yeah works for a minute you know yes <laughs> Just so you can wear it for a second or whatever, you know, that's fine, I think. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yes, my twisted sister hair. Mm -hmm. I said that. You my... looked like D. Snyder. Yes. yes. <laughs> Very D. Snyder girl. Not like strange land D. Snyder, but <laughs> my twisted sister. I'm you know? I, like I know, that. it's you. So, yes. Okay. Was there any, does anybody ask any other questions? Do you have anything else that you want to add to this? I was actually going to be like, um, do you need eye protective eyewear? Because I'm ready. Yeah, no, it's not like a settling torch or anything. <laughs> it's, just, it's a creme brulee, girl. And you right. Can eat, uh, yeah, yeah, you can get all of this stuff on Amazon. Yes, you, know, you can. Like the torch. The torch is like $11, I think. I don't know about you, but Amazon has visited my house every single day since this thing right. started. Every yeah, day. Yeah, I know. I'm just like... <laughs> I'm like, oh, well, hair. you no. know, it is what it is. So. That made my hands look giant. I was, like, typing, and I have these big, like, like huge hands. My, well, my wrists are so dainty from a distance. So. <laughs> I'm such a lady. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm such a lady yeah, if I hide my hands here. in my hair. Yeah, look, I'm going to hold it back here. My hands are so, so tiny. Like... Oh, look at that. I need that. I, know. I need my hair to it's be like offensive. this. 
This oh yeah. I need this to get be, another yeah. one of those wigs and just sew right, it right there. girl. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, we're gonna Double tease this out a little bit more. <laughs> this one's Done. a cheapy bitch. This one was like ten dollars. You can tell when oh, you look I, up close. It's real. Oh, I love real cheap wigs. Like but... you, the what you can do with them, it's fun, girl. Yeah, yeah. It is. we'll do. I'll do a class on how to dye wigs. The oh yeah, I'd ones. like to know that. Yeah. All mine are white anyway. <laughs> Starting it's from a fun, nice base. Like, I like to do like a little like um, ombre. Like I'll do an ombre, like a oh, spray yeah. to like keep it. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah. yeah. So all right, well, thank you so much for being a part of remote learning with Muffy Fish Basket. Yeah. And I learned a lot, and I am going to definitely like. I'm glad I saved all of my broken jewelry because I'm going to be like going yeah, to town on now. some like new stuff, girl. <laughs> Oh, right. This is what everybody is getting for Christmas. So all my drag <laughs> right. sisters and family get ready to get all of my crap. <laughs> yes. My shit is going to be turned into your crap. So enjoy <laughs> that. So, well, thank you. And I hope I get to see you soon at camp. And I hope I we know. get going. I hope so too. Yes. But all better right. safe than sorry. Yes. Right. Everybody, exactly. Everybody wear your masks and wash your face. Yes, your hands. masks. And yes. Uh, social distance. Real and, tea. Real yeah. tea. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And don't drink bleach, no matter what the problem is. Yeah, don't, is. please. For God's sake. Me. I know. Anyway, okay, yay. All right, girl, I will <laughs> talk to you tomorrow morning. We'll be on the phone right. call together with yeah. Keep It. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, Bye, everybody. Bye. <laughs> and I'm trying to end.